geography important five more question and answers question number 1 write about any two multipurpose projects of india construction of dam across rivers is aimed at many purposes hence it is termed as multipurpose river valley projects the various purposes of a dam serves or irrigation hydro power generation water supply for drinking and industrial purpose controlling floods development of fisheries navigation etc bakranangal project it is the highest gravity dam in the world it built across the river satluj the states punjab haryana and rajasthan benefit in this project it irrigates 52609 square kilometer area it produces 1500 megawatt hydro power hirakut project it is the longest dam in the world it built across the river mahanadi the state orissa gets benefit from this project it irrigates 141600 square kilometer area it produces 347.5 megawatt hydro power question number 2 explain the different modes of transport available in tamil nadu roadways railways airways waterways roadways the state has a total road length of 167000 km in which 60628 km are maintained by state highways department ranks second in india with a share of over 20 percentage in total road projects under operation in the public private partnership model railways tamil nadu has a well developed rail network as part of southern railway headquartered at chennai The present Southern Railway network extends over a large area of India's southern peninsula covering Tamil Nadu, Kerala, Puducherry, minor portions of Karnataka and Andhra Pradesh. Tamil Nadu has total railway track length of 6693 km with 690 railway stations in the state. Main rail junctions in the state include Chennai, Coimbatore, Erode, Madurai, Salem, Trichy and Tirunelveli. Chennai has a well established suburban railway network, a mass rapid transport system and is currently developing a metro system. Airways Tamil Nadu has four major international airports. Chennai, Coimbatore, Madurai and Tiruchirappalli airports. or international airports it also has domestic airports at tuticorin and chelam connecting several parts of the country increased industrial activity has given rise to an increase in passenger traffic as well as freight movement which has been growing at over 18 percentage per year waterways tamil nadu has three major ports they are in chennai ennu and tuticorin It has an intermediate port at Nagapattinam and 15 minor ports. All the minor ports are managed by the Tamil Nadu Maritime Board, Chennai Port. Ennur Intermediate Port was recently converted as a major port and handles the major coal and ore traffic in Tamil Nadu. Thank you. If you like this video, like, share and subscribe.